Part of our shoulder trigger point work is getting into the axillary triangle. So these are areas of the teres minor, uh, obviously the infraspinatus. These are some of your rotator cuff muscles for external rotation. Uh, it's a very problematic area that builds trigger points very, I mean, quite often, especially when you've got some shoulder dysfunction. So you can do it laying down. It's actually, I think, a little bit easier to do if you can get on a, a kind of a, a wall like this or a door frame. Take your lacrosse ball, and what we're going to do is we're going to put it right here in this corner of the shoulder. And you can apply as much pressure as you want, just lean into it. And what we're going to do is we're going to force our shoulder into external rotation and then to internal rotation. And as I'm doing this, I'm leaning into that area. So if you can tell my body, I'm kind of pushing my pressure this way and then go back and forth. And I also can stretch it by bringing my taking my elbow and coming across this way as I'm going side to side, just like this. Again, if you find one of those hot spots, just kind of stay on it and you'll feel it kind of gets really kind of warm. Not, not really numb is a sensation I would explain, but kind of like a stretching warm sensation. Sit on that for about 30, 45 seconds to get that trigger point to release.